March weather is always fickle, but even so, it's time to start fishing. Water temperatures above 50 degrees put fish on the move, and early season angling is a great way to shake off the winter blues. Last year, about 285,000 anglers fished in Kansas, and it's a good bet most of them are itching to start fishing again this spring. If you're new to fishing or just want to restock your tackle box, shopping for lures can be overwhelming. Thousands of products line aisles and fill catalog pages. Many of these are best suited to summer fishing. If you want an early start, here are some reliable artificial baits to have on hand. Remember, fish are sluggish in cool waters and they're not quick to chase a meal. Slow is the word. For crappies, jigs suspended from a bobber and fished over structure help hold the lure in place as wave action provides tantalizing motion. When the cork bounces or goes under, set the hook. Many anglers hit marsh lakes and ponds in search of lunker black bass. Inline spinners such as a MEPS provide flash and often trigger strikes. A slow and steady retrieve works best. These lures are deadly and easy to use. Another favorite is the jig and pig or similar lure fished in a slow bouncing motion along bottom structure. These lures mimic a crawdad. Hook a pork trailer on a quarter to half ounce bass jig. Use a heavier jig in deep water or thick vegetation. Most strikes occur as the jig is falling, so set the hook when you feel a twitch. Crankbaits are especially good early in the year. Suspending stick baits like a rogue catch a variety of game fish from bass and stripers to walleyes. Twitched underwater, these baits mimic an injured minnow. Strikes usually come when the lure is paused. Vary the speed of the retrieve as well as the length of the pause until the fish tell you what they want. Anglers often fish at dusk along Kansas dams where spawning walleyes congregate. Here, a favorite lure is the floating minnow-type crankbait like a Rapala or Rebel. Other shallow-running crankbaits like Hottentots are also productive. Reel steadily to keep the lure just underwater. Curly-tailed twister grubs are also good for this type of fishing. Don't miss Kansas early spring fishing. Buy a fishing license and check the department website for fishing reports for the best places to go. Gear up with these early season lures and you're on your way to Kansas Outdoors Adventure. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.